For as long as I can remember, I've struggled a lot with depression and anxiety. I always felt like I had to, to prove something to people, that I had to prove that, that I was lovable and that I had to prove that, that I belonged. So I always felt like I had to be perfect. I felt like I had to be the perfect student. I felt like I had to be the perfect dancer. And so I would set standards for myself. And sometimes I could measure up, but, but even if I did measure up, the next time I, I just had to do better and better. Of course, I, I couldn't do that. No, nobody's perfect. And so like knowing that I would always fail um, created a lot of, a lot of depression. And eventually that, that depression led me to start starving myself. I felt like I had to be the, the perfect dancer and so I had to have the perfect body and that maybe, maybe if I was thin enough, then I would be beautiful and then I, I would be worthy of, of love. But that just led to more depression and more anxiety and I started doing other things to hurt myself. I started cutting myself because I, I just felt like I, I was worthless. Um, I tried to commit suicide and eventually I ended up in the hospital and I realized that I couldn't go on like that. I had grown up in church and I remembered people and I remembered hearing about the joy of the Lord. I decided that I wanted that and so I sought people out who had that and I started reading my Bible and I started praying and I realized what I had heard all my life was true, that, that God loves me. And, and he, he created me because he wanted to. He didn't create me because he had to, but, but that's what he wanted to do. And he sent his son to die for me and to be perfect in my place because he wanted to, not because he had to. And, and knowing how much God really loved me was so healing. And knowing that that security that I have as his child just it, it set me free. There are still places in my life where where I'm waiting for him, but I know that God is good and I know that He loves me and I know that, that that's enough for me. And so that's why I choose to follow Jesus.